Ask anyone about triathlon, and chances are they'll come up with one name, Alistair Brownlee, Olympic champion in London, Olympic champion in Rio, the most dominant short course triathlete in history. My life is a, a life of um, relentless pursuit of goals, focus, hard work, dedication and determination. You know, it's not uh, normal for me to, to do uh, 14, 16 hour effective work days, but it's what I enjoy doing. Brownlee has changed triathlon, altered the way it's raced, regardless of whether his name is on the start list. There are no tactics other than to dominate a race from the outset, winning the mental battle impressing yourself upon your opponents, dominating. But as a legacy is created, so must it be defended. At 32, Brownlee might be forgiven for seeing out his career in a golden comfort zone, but he hasn't. The iron distance beckons. Any challenge cowering under the weight of the Brit's unshakable self-belief. And challenges don't get much bigger than sub-7. So, who can challenge him? Who dares deny this man this record? Brownlee may fly on a race course, but Christian Blumenfeld, he drives a semi-trailer, a Norwegian powerhouse with an almost mythical ability to endure pain, who trains up to eight hours a day, who is as committed as it is possible to be, and as subtle as a sledgehammer. It's maybe a little bit cocky of me, but I've always had uh, the mindset that the armor distance is easy and I can do it better than the ones who is doing it at the moment. The Norwegians are a different breed. All that time in the cold, they have a singular focus, one that has delivered Blumenfeld short course glory and the half iron distance world record twice. So a lot of people ask me like how much I really spend of my day thinking about triathlon and it's it's basically all the time uh, I kind of hate the question of uh, what I do outside of triathlon because it's basically nothing if Brownlee has the grace of a gazelle Blumenfeld is the lion chasing him and both will vie for one prize one never to be repeated sub seven the chase for a place in history.